What's up, world? Welcome back to Radical Investors, where we talk about stocks, crypto, NFTs, and all the ways how to get to the money. I'm Wasu. I'm Hamed. And today we're talking about our favorite company, Ginkgo Bioworks, ticker symbol DNA, and the fact that Kathy Wood just doubled down on it. Let's go! Hey, guys. Thank you so much for coming back to Radical Investors. If this is your first time here, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. You help us grow when you do that, and that's what we're all about here growth let's hop right into the video like we said in the intro kathy wood is doubling down on ginkgo bioworks what do you think about that Hamid? man this is awesome this is awesome news so um going into this past week kathy wood um arc invest had about 18 million shares of dna they just bought another million shares they are adding to their bags and i think it's a smart move yeah so DNA Ginkgo Bioworks, the synthetic biology company, guys, they are de- they're reprogramming um, DNA, basically, right? So it's yeah. like um, they're turning DNA sequence into software, essentially, programming plants to do things that they weren't necessarily um, built to do. So if this works, like we've said it a couple of times, the team is fantastic, and this is a home run play. If they achieve what they're looking to achieve, then this will be... Um, multiple trillions of dollars type of company. This will be like one of those revolutionary type companies um, because it will change literally everything. And uh, Kathy Wood sees that and she's doubling down. Now, Kathy Wood, you know, and and ARK Investment used to be the the darling of the investment world. If you just look back, if you go back 12 months into YouTube and see how many YouTubers and creators were uh, literally just following what Kathy Wood says. And it's so interesting because now a lot of people beat up on Kathy Woods and ARK Investment and they you know, make fun of her. The same very YouTubers right. that were waving the, the Kathy Wood flag uh, are now um, making fun and, and dispersing Kathy Wood and stuff like that. I believe that her investment thesis is very sound. Right. Technology first, innovation first, innovation wins out always. Obviously, right, there's something called market cycles here. Absolutely. Right? Yeah. And we've hit a very rough patch for innovation in the technology companies. But some may argue, like we do, that the, this is an opportunity of a lifetime. Absolutely. Um, opportunities to get into innovation in tech forward companies at very, very, very low prices. And we still feel like these prices will actually go even lower. In, in the very in the, near f- future. So do not feel like you have to jump in. We Obviously, we don't get financial advice here. We haven't said yeah, that in a long yeah. time. We don't but, get financial but, advice. We're but, just telling you our moves. But, but yes, yeah. but you, you don't need to feel the need like you have to jump in right now because we do feel that there's still some more turbulence to come, but you definitely need to have Ginkgo Bioworks, ticker symbol DNA, on your radar. Yeah, there's a lot of in uncertainty in the world right now, and these types of plays, even if the company is sound and is making all of the progress that they are roadmap to make, will still not be valued at what they should be valued. So there's a arbitrage right there that you can take advantage of right now with these prices. And yeah, like my brother said, we don't think it's going to pop up anytime soon because it doesn't need to, right? There's no, unless they make a huge announcement that they just uh, cured some type of cancer, then that might be your um, opportunity where it just shoots up um, in short term. But these types of uh, companies, the research, the, the amount of uh, accreditation they go through to actually validate their successes is a it's a time consuming game and it's a long game so we do think you have you know a couple you know several months to years to continuously accumulate to your bags and um yeah it's funny to hear that you know so many people downplay kathy wood now because her whole model is like she takes five year bets like long term yeah she sells in and out of stuff short term to reposition around but if you see her bag with um dna she has 19 million shares that's a lot a lot of money this is not just one percent we'll look into the details as to how much percent but this is a lot of money we're talking about and again we're looking long term five year to ten year roadmaps and yeah, there's a lot of excitement about DNA. They continue to uh, 
to acquire companies. They, they, there's always more, more press releases that we're going to do more videos on just to, to get out there for you guys. I know a lot of you guys are DNA fan guys like ourselves because we see the writing on the wall. So we will definitely provide you with more videos on DNA. Yeah, and the beautiful thing about DNA is they're in, in a, lot, a lot of verticals, right? Yeah. Because they operate um, basically as an R&D company for uh, other companies. Yeah, and Baylor, etc. Yeah. Uh, Bear and I yeah. think one of the the good things about them is they have a whole food exposure business, right? right? So they have a whole business that is surrounded about making foods more climate change resilient and stuff like that. And guys, think about right now how critical f- food supply chains are being disrupted all over the place because right. of what's going on in Ukraine and in Russia. And think about. Uh, the climate change, how that's impacting our world and how important it's going to be to have um, heat sensitive uh, crops, crops that can um, soak up more nutrients, things like that. Right. And that's what they're working on right now. So they're in so many verticals, um, such a smart team actually delivering on promises, growing, continuing to get investments, flying underneath the radar, because obviously pre um, market correction. They weren't the darlings of Wall Street right. anyway because they have a different business model. Obviously, during this market correction, um, a lot of the Wall Street institutional money outside of Ark Invest isn't running to them because obviously of the things we just said. I just said, but guys, if they achieve even half of what they're looking to yeah. achieve, it's going to be generational generate generational wealth for the investors in the company. And we think that's um, something that you do not want to miss. Yeah. And that's all we have for you guys today. As always, happy hunting. Hit that comment section. Let us know what you want to see a video on next. As always, happy hunting. Peace. Peace.